Hey guys, this is going to be a quick video on how to change the upgrade thumbnail for your monkeys. What we're going to do is we're going to change the first upgrade for the dart monkey to look like this. So let's get started. So I've got JPEX up. We're going to go to script, scroll down until you see towers, open up towers, and we're going to be back in to uh, tower factory again. Then you're going to scroll down until we get to the upgrade path for the dart monkey, which is going to be below the tower definitions right here. So we're just going to scroll down to the right until, okay, so there's the long range dart. So that's the upgrade we're looking for. And bang, right here where it says thumb is the assets.upgrades.long range darts. We're going to change long range darts to bigger stacks, which is just the one below it. I've clicked on that part with the long range darts and it opens up in P code right up here. So I'm going to click edit P code. I'm going to hover over long range darts and I'm going to delete that and replace it with bigger stacks. Now you can replace it with anything. This is really more of just like a how to. So in the future, if you guys uh, want to make mods with different upgrade thumbnails, you'll know how. And if you need the name, it's right below. Anyways, go ahead and click save. Click OK. Save it one more time. And now let's uh, test it out. So I'm in game. I'm going to click on the dart monkey. Place them down, and as you can see, the upgrade thumbnail for the first upgrade has been changed. This doesn't actually change the upgrade at all. If I click on this, you'll see that it performs just the same as it did before. It's also using the mod we made before. Um, and that's really irrelevant to changing the upgrade path. But you can see that it doesn't actually make it start producing spikes. This is just changing the icon for the upgrade itself. You can also see it doesn't change the way that the monkey actually looks. It's just the upgrade. Well, that's the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comments section or join the Discord server, which is linked in the description. There's a lot of really knowledgeable people in there that can help you out. Also, if you're not sure how I got any of this or where any of this is coming from, watch the first part in this tutorial series. It's going to cover how to get everything set up so you can make mods for Balloons Tower Defense 5 Flash. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.